young woman, there she is, her name is Robin. She called me up. She said, Dr. Brian, I can't get out of bed. I said, what's the problem? She had menstrual pain, and a lot of women have some cramps, but for maybe one in 10, they are so bad about one day a month that you can't go to work. She, she had a, a business trip the next day. She said, I can't get on a plane, I can't even move. And so I said, okay, what's going on here? I can give you some painkillers for a couple of days, but how are we gonna stop this from happening again next month and the month after that? And I gave her a prescription that I don't think anybody had ever given to a menstrual pain patient before, but here's why. She was describing her suffering. There she is. Oh, it's terrible. I said, look, let's make a diet change. Do you want to try an experiment with me? She said, I'll try anything. I said, okay, here's the experiment. No animal products for the next month. And keep oils to a bare minimum. A little bit later, I'm going to tell you why I suggested these things. But there's plenty of healthy things left to eat. And she said, I'll try it. She called me up four weeks later and said, this is amazing. My period arrived zero pain, no symptoms at all. And the same was true the next month, and the next month, and the next month. Unless she would change her diet, bring in greasy stuff, then she would pay for it at the end of, the, of that month. And so I thought, okay, that's great, but we need to study this more and see if this really would work for a larger group of people. So along with the Georgetown University Department of OBGYN, I did a randomized trial where we brought in a large group of women. They all had moderate to severe pain and half of them went on a low fat, completely vegan diet. Now a vegan diet for anybody who is new, a, a vegan diet does not mean that you're from the planet Vegas. It just means you're not eating animal products at all. And so the other group got a supplement that was actually a placebo, just a dummy pill for comparison. And then after two months, two cycles, the diet group started taking the supplement and the supplement group started the diet. So we were crossing them over. And it worked. Uh, we published our results in the Journal of Obstetrics and Gynecology and what we found was that it reduces pain, it reduced PMS symptoms, bloating, mood changes, lots of things were affected by this rather simple diet change. Wild. Well, in the course of the study, we asked all of the participants not to use any kind of hormonal medications. So if a woman was, uh, say, taking birth control pills, that's a hormone, and since our study is looking at hormone effects, that would goof up what we're doing. So we said, if you're sexually active, please use some other kind of contraception, not the pill. One of the women in the study said, Dr. Barnard, don't worry about me. I don't use any contraception at all. My husband and I gave up the idea of having a baby five years ago. And we were both evaluated. Why couldn't we get pregnant? It's not him. It's me. I don't ovulate. So we haven't used any kind of contraception. <laughs> The second month that she was on the low-fat, healthy, plant-based diet, she came into our research center and she said, Dr. Barnard, I've got some bad news and I've got some good news. I said, what is it? The bad news is I'm leaving your study. And the good news is I am pregnant. And she gave birth to a healthy baby and another one and a third baby. And so here's the point. Robin, the young woman who called me up with menstrual pain, did not have a disease. She was out of balance. And this woman, her name is Ella, she, she was not infertile. She was out of balance. And yet, what doctor is going to explain to you, here's how your hormones work, and here's how a diet change could affect them. They're not going to explain that because the science is still murky in many ways, and we're not taught these things in medical school anyway, and we're frankly much more comfortable saying, you're infertile or here are medications, or you can do various expensive treatments or something like that. But in some cases, the answers are simpler and are right in front of us.